obviously filmed off my new camera um, I hope the quality was good and you enjoyed it if you're wondering where I am I'm actually in pure gym the other 24-hour gym in uh, my area the reason is I was a member of the gym I cancelled the membership because I'm joining the family gym and I went there because obviously the family doesn't open until this Sunday the lockdown the four weeks was actually held, so I should still have four weeks of like use of that gym. Tried my pin code, wouldn't let me in. Absolute joke. So I have to come and actually pay to go to this gym. I was not gonna waste any more money in the gym if they're gonna not even let me train, you know, when I'm actually owed four weeks. Absolute joke. But today's video if you are wondering what that title is all about this is a new series it's coming up to a new year and it's time yes you aren't going to say oh it's off that film pain no gain the reason is i've called it that is because if you're not going through some pain you're never going to gain and that is 
in any situation. It doesn't mean the gym, it means in life in general. And usually, a lot of people go through life if they've got it pretty easy and they don't gain much or they don't achieve much or they don't appreciate it much. The people who have gone through pain usually get the biggest gain. Usually learning about themselves or about other people, um, achieving more in life, and that's the same when you're training in the gym. If you're not in pain, you're not gonna gain. If you're not sore at the end of a workout, you're not gonna gain. If you're not sweating or tired after a workout or got doms after two or three days because you've done a really hard workout, you're not gonna gain. If you're going through the week and doing easy reps and you're not and you're making it easy on yourself, you need to change your way about going to the gym. You need to change your style. You need to change your workout. You need to get more intense. You need to get more hard on yourself. You need to go through that pain barrier to gain more. And that's what I'm going to do over the next year. I don't know what's gonna happen because we obviously, we have got no clarification what's gonna happen next year. Yes, there's a vaccine out now and people are gonna take it, but does that mean shows are gonna um, come back on? These body barrels are gonna be on, you know. If we do get to, um, clarification maybe by the end of February, I will be competing at Body Power. If we don't, then I won't be. I'll be carrying on with my bulk because this is a gaining period. This pain, no gain series, it's all about going through them pain barriers, doing stuff I've never ever done before, hitting PBs I've never ever done, lifting weight that I should have been doing years ago, but I've obviously chickened out doing pussy reps for years when I was younger because I had no experience. Now I've got the experience, now I've got the knowledge to make myself 100% better than I am now. At the end of the video, I'm gonna show you my physique update. This is my starting block of my gaining. I'm gonna be lean bulking and I'll be telling you all the way through the lean bulking, what I'm doing, you know, what meals I have. I do not wanna gain any more fat than I've got now. In all fairness, I want to actually lose the fat I've got on my body now. I'm going to be eating clean at least six days of the week. One day, probably on the Saturday, with my son, I'll have a film night and have a, you know, we call it the picnic, where we have a bit of junk food, you know, and watch some films. But I'm going to be bulking up slowly. At the moment, I'm going to be hitting 2,500 calories. I'm roughly about 175 pounds. I really, by the end of, February, when I know if body power is on or not, I want to be at least 185, you know, lean, you know, and in good physique. So I can then prep for 12 weeks and compete on men's physique. Um, but I'm going to show you my physique now and end the video with my physique. A bit of lighting like this is key. I actually didn't think I would look this good in this lighting anyway. And my motivation has changed. I, I have been waiting to get back to the gym. Well, it's a new year coming up. I've got a new camera. I've got a lot of goals. And I really want to get into that new gym. A proper, proper bodybuilding gym. And yeah, it's, it's gonna be, it's, this series is gonna be the best series, probably the best videos I've done. Also, while I'm doing this, I'm, um, I'm shouting out anybody who's on YouTube who watches me, comment down or email me on Instagram. If you wanna train with me and you wanna come down to where I live and train, message me 
and we'll get a video together. Or if you don't live absolutely miles away, then I'll come up to you, you know. I wanna do some actually more vlogging with people. As you know, if you are a YouTuber and you do fitness, it, one thing that is really, really hard, um, what we don't get the loyalty of, which big YouTubers, is we have to film it ourselves. So we can't get the angles that we want, you know. But if two of us come together, we can help each other out, get some really sick footage. So if anybody is interested, then please, obviously message me and we'll arrange something over the next month, two months, in the next year, you know, and get some sick actual videos. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video of my new series, please give it a massive thumbs up and if you're not subscribed, hit that bell button and I will see you next time.